all right so release notes for today it's halloween okay the gates to the mad realm have opened once again and krita's most infamous monarch mad king thorin has Ooh. returned to old court in lion's arch loyal vassals of the king are strongly encouraged to enjoy festivities meet the denzians of the mad what what in yes, the events means. across krita tour the mad realm itself in the mad king's labyrinth and fearsome mad king's clock tower jumping puzzle darren's you have to do it backwards now that's true um, i do have to do it that is true compete with your fellow mortals in lunatic inquisition reapers rumble and the mad king's raceway attend the king's whims attend to the king's whims in his notorious mad king says game or match wits and blades against royalty in ascent to madness wow wow so many cool things that we could not have predicted that was coming i cannot the believe lions. this is happening okay, this is so like, exciting we couldn't, have, we couldn't have seen it the lion's arch captain's council wishes to remind citizens that they are not affiliated with the Crichton monarchy and cannot guarantee the safety of any individuals who choose to dabble in dangerous realms. I like the RP. Otherwise. I like the yeah, RP. The, the RP is pretty nice. Is very, like, it's very good. That is very nice. Um, yeah. yeah, this is very, very good. All right, so I'm assuming this is like new stuff for like this year. So yeah. a new variant of the long feared Mad King's clock tower has appeared. Wait, Wait what? what? Wait, what? 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 Wait, what? What does I that mean? Okay, keep reading. Let's see. Okay. Normally unavailable to visitors during maintenance, guests are now welcome to enter the stopped clock tower, an inc incarnation of the tower's daunting climb with less time pressure. Oh, just easy uh -huh. mode. Okay. A bit Existing cringe, achievements. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> okay. Uh, existing achievements have been updated to reflect which version of the tower they can be completed in, That's and fine. new achievements have been added for players conquering each variant. It's That's a, so cool. It's a, it's a training. Tower. It's a training. It's a training clock tower. That's a new good, clock a good tower. <laughs> yeah, so it's fine. It's okay. New con. Yeah. I mean, it's not new content. It's not new content. It's not new content. Let's not pretend here. That's not new content. But it's it's better. It's nice. All right. Next one. All right. The annual Halloween rituals meta achievement has been updated with a fashionable new reward. The Clawing Shadow Greaves. Earn this Yo. spooky new armor piece by completing a variety of Halloween activities. Halloween activities, I Halloween should say. Halloween activities. And show your allegiance to the Mad King's court with pride. Last year's oh. meta achievement reward, the Clawing Shadow Gloves, can now be purchased from Halloween vendors if you've missed it. Okay, so that's awesome. Um. The new Grim Machine weapon set nice. is now available. New weapon set, yeah. You'll receive your choice of a weapon by progressing the annual uh, Halloween Rituals meta achievement <laughs> or the weekly Halloween Festival achievement. Okay. As per usual, four makeshift paper bag helm skins are right. now available for heroes yeah. to show their Halloween spirit on a budget. Yeah, guys, get that paper <laughs> bag. Very cute. To earn these helms, you'll need to bring your materials to a mysterious crafts raven atop the stopped clock tower. Okay, so you gotta yeah. go up there. Yeah, and this one used to be this is this skin awesome. was here for like ten years and no one used it, right? Paper bag, get or shoe. Mm -hmm. Like it wasn't available yeah, can, for a long time, right? Uh, but now you yeah. can get it after ten years, even though it's in the game mm -hmm. for all these years, right? But they just never released yeah. it. Yeah. No, I love that. Um Okay, so uh, three new weapons are now available in the courtly weapons weapon chest, which can be rarely found by opening trick or treat bags. They can also be purchased from Sparking Stone. Sparking, okay. Sparking, yeah, Sparking in right, cool. Lions Arch. Those paper uh, bag skins are huge. I'm they're welcome. huge. They're, they're beautiful. Huge. Oh, I want to see. They them. are beautiful. Um, the long-awaited mini. Durlitz, the Candy Raven. I mean, the Candy Raven. The Candy Raven is now available from Halloween vendors. Okay, so a mini. Nice. Uh, new Halloween themed guild decorations have been added. Oh, that's nice. 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 Uh, many small issues have been addressed to ensure a more polished festival experience for all visitors to the Mad Realm. Many small issues. I guess those are bugs, right? I guess. Yeah, I mean, that sounds like 
bug facility. Yeah, that's yeah. But I mean, that's good, right? We love that. Uh, the gates to the Mad Realm will open for three weeks from October 17th to November 7th. Have a happy Halloween. Yeah, and, really and I guess in ho no November 7th is when the next patch is going to come out probably as well. Uh, I think. Yeah, probably. I yeah. would think so, yeah. yeah. All right, so let's let's get into it. World Polish added a proper name for one of the legendary Leyline Anomalies attacks. I don't know okay, what the fuck that means. What does that know. mean? I don't know what that means. I guess he does like an attack and it's like his, you know, they named it after him. I guess, him. but I don't always, know. okay. Does it tell us that is, that is so random. Does it, yeah. does it tell <laughs> us that that is the, like, oh, like he's doing the attack, guys. Is that... Is that a thing? He's like, attacking. Yeah, he's like, because I guess he didn't tell you that. I don't know. That's weird. But okay. But I, we'll have to okay. see it. We'll have to see it. Yeah, we'll have to investigate. Yeah, we'll have to uh, investigate. Fixed an issue that could prevent the legendary bandit executioner's orbiting projectile from correctly following the bandit. Okay. That's why I died to the champion, guys. See? They saw mm -hmm. my clip dying to it. And like, we can't have to fix this. We cannot let Darren's die again. Mm -hmm. That's what happened, guys. See? It was not my fault. It was the game's fault. Okay. True. In the combat um, load when you get hit? Oh, that makes sense. Oh, okay. They, they didn't fix the tidal wave at spot. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe. No, I think that one's fine. Maybe I think that's, uh, that one is okay. Yeah, I think that's fine. I think that's how it should post the board. Yeah, that's what happened. Um, fixed an issue that could prevent... Oh, I just read that one. Fixed a scaling issue in the Defeat the Giant Destroyer Troll event in Timberline Falls. Fixed an issue that could cause the instance owner to be stuck behind a door. Okay, he's stuck. During okay. the silence story mission. I that is that something is. that would happen to me. Um, cool. Fixed a stalling issue that could occur during the story mission. The battle for Cragstead. Wait, okay. really? I didn't know that was... Okay, cool. That's good to know. Mm -hmm. right, cool. Fixed a stalling issue that could occur when reaching the Eye of the North while replaying the Voice in the Deep story mission. Uh, yeah, that one I think I've encountered before, so that's nice. It's, me too. Yeah. No. Uh, fixed an issue that caused uh, a looping conversation with Hal the Hermit. Okay. Hmm. Just, he just keeps going. He just yeah, didn't did, stop. Yeah, and getting a lot of issue, like fixed issues from like the core game, it seems, or like very new player yeah. stuff. They're really focusing on the new player stuff, it seems. And like even really polishing, yeah. Yeah, and even the Leyland Anomaly thing is like, why are they trying to like put every attack into the logs of stuff? Maybe that's what they're trying to do. Which is honestly kind of kind of yeah, they kind of making the game a little more polished, I guess. I know what that's that nice. is the consequence yeah. of this, but yeah, it's kind of interesting that they're doing this, right? Yeah, no, it's great. Um, yeah. Fixed an issue. Oh, no, wait. Yeah, removed. Remove. I skipped one. Oh, my God. Removed an invalid interaction prompt in Saitung I, I, I have no idea what that means. I don't know what that is. Yeah. I have no idea. Fixed an issue that caused the Jahai Bluffs Griffin Expert Achievement to be awarded when completing other adventures. <laughs> wait, That's what? Hilarious. <laughs> that is. <laughs> so you just did like random other adventure? Oh, you just random. did Fungus Among Us? Like, now you are. Yeah, high bluffs Griffin <laughs> expert Pog. Like, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> like, Jesus. That's so weird. That's All right. So weird, yeah. uh, items fixed an issue that caused chickens to be slightly embedded <laughs> in the ground. When <laughs> Wait, viewing... what the fuck? It's funny. When I viewing never... a preview of the endless mystery foul tonic. Oh, oh man, gosh. I wish I would have known that before I patched. Fuck, now I will never that be is, able to see this. This is so sad, hilarious. man. That's so yeah. fucked, man. All right, whatever, dude. Fuck me. All right, trick or treat bags have extremely rare chance oh. to drop enchanted music boxes. Yo, Mo Gamba guys? Any gamblers Gamba? in the chat, boys? Are we, are we Gamba? I'm yeah. gambling, boys. I'm going in. Yeah. He's getting in. It says extremely rare. I just, I'm I just like, I mean, extremely rare for anyone else but me, but yeah, thank you. I, don't, I don't know about that. Yeah. Fixed an issue that prevented the gentle garden swing chair animations from being displayed to other players. Oh, okay, okay. oh yay. I am actually happy about that one. Oh, I was there pretty you go. sad when I got it because I was like, oh, no one can see you swinging. Oh, oh now you can. Okay, yeah. that's, okay, that's, that's, that's really sad. It. That's very nice. That's very really nice that they fixed it. It's pretty vulgar. Okay. Uh, fixed an issue that caused the pocket jade armor to disappear earlier than intended. Okay. Okay. Uh, profession skills. This is, yeah, we love this. General, 
Relic of Leadership fixed an issue that caused this relic to convert more conditions than intended. It was OP. Too many conditions. Control. Uh, Mesmer. Okay, Chrono specifically. Split second. Reduce the total power coefficient from 1.33 over to... What? What is this? This is a I lot mean, of numbers. That's a Just, lot. You, you look, can they, look at it. Yeah. Oh, it's because the of the Mesmer clones. clones. Like, if you have oh. one clone, it's 133. If you have two clones, you have two, 132. Right, three, right. Three, Based on the number of active clones to one. So it's lower. Wow, now. they're nerfed by a lot, actually. Based so, on oh, number Jesus. of active clones in PvP only. Oh, uh, okay. okay. So, that, yeah. Which okay, kind of makes sense. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. Uh, Necromancer. Uh... Death Nova increased the minion summoning interval from f three seconds to fifteen seconds in World v World only. Reduced the power coefficient from zero point six to zero point three in World v World only. Okay. Uh, summon Madness. Reduced the number of minions summoned from eight to four in World v World only. Oh my goodness. Uh, Reaper Rise. Reduced the maximum number of targets from two to one in World v World only. Uh, Ranger, Signet of the Hunt, increased cooldown from uh, 25 seconds to 30 seconds in PvP only. Okay. Uh, okay, Soul B, specifically, One Wolf Pack, reduced the duration from 8 seconds to 6 seconds in World v. World only. Increased the strike interval from 0 0.25 seconds to 0.5 seconds in World v. World only. This is a lot of World v. World. Yeah, it seems like there's uh, a lot of builds are kind of like yeah the fucking yeah, reaper build from necromancer yeah. uh i mean this one is the chronomancer one is for a pp chrono build that fucking suck mm -hmm. and just one shot you and i guess the ranger one is for another one that also one shot you and in world's world i have no idea this must be like a roamer uh yeah a roamer one but definitely I'm not sure though. i don't know about the ranger one yeah but. i don't know for sure but yeah reduce the power coefficient from 0 0.63 2.5 in world v world only untamed Natural fortitude reduced reduced life siphon damage from one one thousand. Okay, oh. so it was like over seventeen hundred to one thousand PvP only. Okay, so that's been significantly. That's reduced. a lot. Let loose. That is quite a bit. Uh, yeah. Let loose. This trait no longer grants fury in PvP and World v World. Okay. 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 Multi shot fixed a bug Jesus. that allowed the skill to be. Fired behind the user. Okay, that's I'm gone down. I mean, that's yeah, pretty that's, funny. Yeah. I did that to solve right. the world build in less than two seconds from mountain to zero HP. I died. I died. Dude, that's crazy, oh. actually. Yeah. yeah. Well, then good thing they changed that. That's a little bit too much. Mm -hmm. uh, Revenant. Missed swing. Reduced the maximum number of targets from five to three. Okay. Missed slash. Reduced the number of targets from wow. five to three. Huh? Okay, Arcane Mist. Overall, oh, this is like PvP? everywhere. That's crazy, actually. That's this is a, like just. A that is a lot. That is wow. a big one. Wait, Mist Swing. Mist Swing. Isn't that like. That's yeah, that, the, that's great Vindicator. Sword auto that's Great Sword. Yeah. Auto yeah. So they're kind of nerfing Vindicator in Warver's World. I, yeah. I mean, this doesn't really matter the, the as much in PvE, right? I mean, I guess yeah, the Queen is kind of worse, but it's not that bad. Well, yeah. Uh, Arcing Miss reduced the number of targets from five to three. Okay, so the same thing there. Yeah. Uh, True Strike reduced the power coefficient per block stack from 0 0.3 to 0 0.05 in World v. World only. That's a lot. Jeez. Yeah, that 0 is a lot. 0.3 to 0 0.05? That's a lot. That's a big nerf. Yeah. Isn't that a um, killer? I don't know. We'll see. Well, Thief. Swindler's uh, equally, equally brim. <laughs> Fixed an issue that prevented this trait from properly reducing the recharge of steel. Okay. Uh, Spectre. Endless Night. Reduced the slow duration from 0 0.5 seconds to 0 0.25 seconds in PvP only. Reduced the torment duration from 6 seconds to 5 seconds in PvP only. So again, PvP. Um... Warrior. Okay, so Berserker. Savage Instinct. Reduce the duration from two seconds to one second in PvP only. Uh, blood reaction. Yeah, blood reaction. Reduce the precision to f ferocity conversion from 10% to 5% in World v. World only. Again, geez. Fatal, uh, Fatal Frenzy. Reduce the power bonus from 300 to 150 in World v. World only. Eternal Champion. 
Reduce the stability duration from 3 seconds to 2 seconds in PvP only. Sundering Leap and uh, increased the cooldown from 15 seconds to 18 seconds in PvP only. Okay. This is like a lot so of the, PvP. So they're nerfing, they're nerfing, stuff. yeah, they're nerfing Berserker build, which honestly was pretty yeah. good. I don't know if it needed a nerf. I don't know. Well, I, don't, I don't believe it works mm. all that much. And I did, but they are nerfing the PP Condi Berserker, which yeah. was fucking disgusting and horrible. So oh I don't know if it's good. Yeah. I don't know if it's gonna be enough. We'll see, but um, but you know, it's it, it is. They did nerf it for a okay amount, I guess. But I mean, stability from three seconds to two seconds is that enough? I don't know if that's enough. It doesn't seem that much. I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out. And the really. cooldown. I mean, we'll see. I guess we'll see how it happens. Yeah. I don't know if it's gonna be enough though. I think it's gonna be still good. We'll see though. I think it'll still be good, but yeah, we'll we'll really have to play around with it. Yeah. Um, Blade Sworn, Unshakable Mountain, reduced base yeah. barrier. This one's from one thousand to eight. Uh, uh, 800 in PvP only. Uh, combat Stimulant, reduced base healing in PvP only. Uh, stims, that one, I mean, that's a, that's like a decent reduction, yeah. Uh, stim State, reduced base healing, again, in PvP only. Uh, Gunstinger, uh, increase the ammunition recharge from 15 seconds to 18 seconds in PvP only. Yeah, I mean, honestly, the Blade Storm build was fucking busted as well. It was crazy good. Um, I just played a little bit, so I'm not sure how much this is going to affect everything. Uh, it just seems like it was just healing too much, but the damage seems, like, unchanged. And it was doing an insane amount of damage, so mm -hmm. I guess it's just more squishy now. Which I guess is okay, but is yeah. that enough? I don't know. I feel like it's still going to be very, very good. I um, think it'll still be pretty good, yeah. Um, yeah, long over World Shaker, World. World, World. Enough, yeah. This is interesting, actually. Added an exotic back item oh, and heavy, nice, medium, and light aquatic headgear to the unidentified, uh, un unified, sorry, uh, vendor system vendor, uh, vendor system vendor in World v World. So you can go get your. Uh, yeah, that's nice. That's good. Your, that's good. Yeah, I mean, that is, that is, the, it's good that they added that in. Yeah. Yeah, this vendor essentially sends you, uh, sells you every exotic from the game, like you know, in with a selectable stat, so you can get whatever you want. Now they're adding the exotic. Um, back item and also the uh, headgear which is also important people need it so it's kind of nice uh, also it's kind of surprising that they didn't have it before beforehand but there you go late yeah. patch notes is that, a bit more is weird. yeah and there's a few more okay general fixed a rare client crash that occurred when returning to the character oh my god screen. they fixed that Fix it. Dude, that's the best shit. Like, you know when you fucking change characters and you, as soon as you click on it, it's just like oh, disconnect and you have to relaunch the game and it's fucking the most annoying shit ever? Is that what they fix? Because holy fuck, they fixed that. Oh, I'm gonna be so happy, man. Fuck me. That's so good. Oh, god damn. All right. What next? Uh, fixed an... Okay, so again, more World v. World fixes. Fixed an issue that could cause incorrect map queue numbers to be displayed. That's good. Uh, fix an issue that caused Q is ready pop-ups to disappear after loading screens. Okay. I'm pretty sure I've actually encountered this one. Yeah. Uh, fixed an issue that caused Q slots to be held longer than expected after players selected re-enter Q or leave Q. Okay, And nice. that's it. That's good. That's good. I mean, that's, they really fixed a lot yeah, of good. good. They, they really did fix a lot of stuff. I'm happy. Yeah. I mean, I mean, we kind of expected like this is kind of like what we would um, get. It's not like we were gonna, we weren't really expecting anything huge. I would think. Yeah. I wouldn't think. Yeah. yeah. We're gonna do a few things, guys. We're gonna one see all the new skins that we can get. Uh, two, we're gonna see the new cock tower, and maybe we're gonna do the dailies as well. So we are getting. Oh, so we got, we got, we got the new meta achievement, Clown Shadow Greaves. We got that. We got the new green machine weapon sets, paper bag helm skin, and we got the Corley weapon chest as well, and the minis. And the mini, there's it, the candy raver. Let's see if we can actually get all of them before we we have to go to the alpha. Let's see. All right, let's see. <laughs> Mad King uh, Clock Tower. Let's get the paper bag. Okay, so the, how does it work? It works. It's time activity untimed. explorable. Oh, it's called explorable. Let's see how it goes. Okay, this is the uh, this is the doc this is the uh, easy version, guys. As you can see, I mean, I don't know if this is always how it looks, but it might just be. Wait, is he playing though? What do I do? Do I have to talk to him? Let's go. I'm ready to climb. Oh, you can just go whenever. Oh, cool. Yeah, it's the uh, explorable path. Did you the explorable the path, guys. Ex the harder yeah. version, yes. Oh, look, everything is already here. That's kind of nice. 
have to do all my Halloween dailies on GeForce now on my phone. Oh no. Oh my god. Okay, that's pain. I mean, look, it's just Halloween dailies. It's kind of not that hard, guys. Come on. Halloween. It's easy. It's Halloween, dude. It's easy. What if you fail, though? Like, do you have to, like, huh? No! Oh, dude. Oh, oh it's okay. Because it's not the, it's the times, it's the tame version, so it doesn't matter if you fall down. No! <laughs> hey, see, guys, it already worked. No. Dude, like, it's just too, it's too easy. It's, it's, it's thinking, it's making me think it's, like, I don't Actually, know, like, my brain good. is confused, you know? Like pretty good for people who haven't really done it before so that's yeah like yeah because i think the biggest reason yeah, why it's I... hard to do it is because if you have the time it's like oh i can't practice right but in here I'm you can random, practice and you can actually tell super quick yeah works. yeah i think it's a good way of doing it honestly i'm not gonna lie i think it's a a, a good addition and it gives oh dead! okay wait can you glide in the yeah, normal version glide. no no in the normal version yeah, yeah i think so uh, okay. i believe so you okay, can yeah okay, okay. Wait, what? Wait, oh, I have to jump over. Like, wait, it'll be nice too because some people no can kind of boost their confidence level like in doing this mode, and then you know eventually maybe go back and be like, okay, I've practiced the path thing enough. Like, you know, I can get back in here. Yeah, Where I think going? so. I think so too. You have to jump down. I think. Oh. you have to jump down. You have to jump down. Did Lara did it backwards last year? Yeah, she did. Yeah, Wait. she's giga chat. Okay, can I get my bag though? My paper bag. Mad King chest. Candy corn cob. Chest of equip. Wow, now it gives you chest of element. All this equipment? That's crazy. Ooh. That's very good for new players. They're really going hard on new player yeah, stuff, right? Really Man, good. it's crazy. That's actually oh. insane how, far, how hard they're going with them. I'm opening all my bags. Because I trust. Oh. I didn't get anything. Trust? You trust Oh, there you go. You can foods? buy the paper bag now from uh, this guy. Okay, cool. Oh, you need to buy the carny corn gobs, though. You're to get them. I keep missing a jump. I am oh, so my God. <laughs> yeah, you can just do this, guys. You can just do this. And now you uh, you get your um, you get your carny corn gob. And you get uh, your paper bag. And you can choose the face you want to have on it. Look at that. Beautiful. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. You can't uh, pre glide previously, so in the normal version you can glide. Yeah, I thought so. This is a PP lobby, so it doesn't work. Your inventory is a crime. It could be worse. It will be worse. Don't worry. Okay, I what else? Pretty bad too. Daily Halloween. So we do want to do that. So that just gives me the typical stuff, right? It's fine. All right, cool. Do you guys make it? Did you, or are you guys dead? Do you guys make it? Are you done? Yeah, I got it. I made it up. Okay, now we have to do the green machine weapon set and the black line weapons. Uh, there's apparently a new set on the store. I mean, on the on the chest. So let's check them out. I think Dumat sent them to me. Yeah, Dumat. There we go. So we got this ones, right? So you got typical stuff. The Evan Grasher to and Treat Bag. The Dark Abbey saw weapons and the Lord Keeper. Okay, cool. But also, look at this. Reconfigurable Construct Great Sword Skin. Oh wait, that's I already have this one. Forget it. Wait, what do you mean I don't have it? I thought I got it. Well, I like it. Okay, I think it's cool. It's a cool skin. It looks pretty awesome and he moves around. That's kind of based. It's a very cool skin. It's a very cool skin. I like it. No new set, yeah. But that weapon is kind of nice though. I would agree. I would agree. <sighs> All right. Uh, what else? Um. We got the machine uh, weapons, green machine weapon shop. Uh, it's not available. Just from the meta achievement or the weekly Halloween festival. So the meta achievement from Halloween. So I guess it's this one. Green machine chest. Yeah, yeah. And clown shadow greaves box. Oh, so you can get the little. Oh, because we back that like back uh, last last uh, year we got the gloves, right? Uh, the gloves, uh, which are this ones, right? Uh, let me see if I find it. Right, shadowed. There we go. Clawing shadow gloves. Are right, this ones right? And now we have gotten this greaves, uh, those boots, which look pretty awesome, honestly. Very edgy. Uh, you skip the glider. What the fuck? Oh, there's a glider. As well. Personal gyro capture chair glider combo. Okay, that's pretty cool. Wow, that's crazy. They put this as a glider. 
That's insane! Holy fuck! That's in the black lion fucking uh, wow. the black lion chest. That's crazy that they put that. That's insane. I can't believe they did this. That's a lot. That's pretty awesome. I mean, I'm swapping for that, dude. I'm getting some keys and bro, let's go. Oh, that's sick. That is sick. I know. It is sick. It's crazy. I, I'm kind of surprised that they went so hard on like a Look fucking random festival. I don't know. Well, even on the keys, legit. honestly. That's legit. Yeah, it's a lot. Okay, we can also get. That's a chair too. It's a chair and a glider. Yeah, it's honestly crazy. Okay, uh, we also got the green machine chest, and now for the wardrobe, let's go check here for the um, green machine weapons. Green machine weapon skin. Green machine. Okay, so these are the ones that you get from the weekly or the annual. Let's see how they look. This is the meta achievement. So this one you can buy. You have to do the... Wow, that looks cool. And look. They're doing... They're, they have light. They have a little... They have a little smoke on them. A little trail. And they also have the little, uh, you know, machine gears going out. That's awesome, dude. Look at that hammer. God damn. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like it. Those are nice skins. Yeah, and you have to... You cannot buy this ones. They're actually... It means that you have fucking done weeklies for a long time. Very cool set, actually. Very nice set. The great sword. It looks like a fucking gun. It looks like a rifle, honestly. The pistol. The rifle. <laughs> the rifle is a bit too much smoke. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but it's pretty good. Staff. Yeah, it makes sense. Torch. The torch makes sense, right? It's a cool. It's a cool idea. A lot of effort put in here. The shield looks sick. Okay, the, the, the shield looks sick. Oh my god, that's fucking awesome. Very cool sets. Very cool update, very cool sets. I'm happy with the new Halloween. So, I don't know if this one's regarded this week, but uh, I mean this season, uh, this, uh, this update, but we did, you know, we do have a lot of them, right? We have this one, which honestly looks pretty cool. It's a very big axe. It's like almost like a great axe. This great sword, Jesus, that looks cool. I haven't seen this one before. God damn, luminous wings. That's a good fucking skin. They're very expensive though. 15 candy corn gobs and they're like five gold each. This is an insane expensive skin. I would not, you're gonna have to invest a lot or maybe getting a word of unlock, but like it's it's a lot, right? This shield also looks pretty cool. This one looks pretty cool as well. That's a, ni that's a nice staff, yeah, that's nice. That's kind of cute. The Halloween spirit. It's almost like the uh, pumpkin is growing from the staff. Kind of cool. Pale Lights Companions, pretty awesome. Sanctified Executioner. Yo, look at that great sword. God damn, that's pretty crazy. That's pretty cool. You're gonna fucking chop off someone's head with this. Guide Executioner, also pretty cool. Harold with Executioner. Alright, so I'll, I'll next you use set. Pretty cool. Okay. That looks pretty nice, yeah. I think so.